There we go. 252,000. Continue to the wheels. So let's start on the front wheels. Beautiful rear LEDs. 3D shaped. M8 competitions. Oof. This is M mode, guys. <laughs> Gearing up not too small, not too big. What's up guys, one day after my birthday, first of all I want to thank everybody for their birthday wishes and I welcome you at BMW Amsterdam with this convertible in front of us. Yes, it's the flagship of BMW M, the M8 competition convertible. The M8 is not to fool around with. What's also a nice fact is that this label M8 is actually the first one ever for a full road production you might know that the 8 series has replaced the 6 series because BMW wanted to lift up their whole class experience especially the whole luxury okay guys enough teasing of this beauty let's have a look at the total spec list of this specific M8 competition convertible and the total end price in the Netherlands alrighty spec list of the M8 competition convertible starting price in the Netherlands 211k 995 euros the color of this spec is brand hatch grau and the interior leather is full leather merino taruma brown uh, with swatch by the way okay base options m sport differential but of course anti-theft class 3 comfort exit display key electric adjustable front seats, interior carbon fiber trims, high beam assistant, active guard, so a lot of base options on the M8. Like it should be connected drive, including BMW online, live cockpit professional, M seats, high shadow line. Base options check, these are the specific selected options. Let's highlight a few. 9,396 euros, that's almost 10k, 4M carbon ceramic brakes. What do we have more? Soft closing, seat venting in the front, heat comfort package, air color, BMW laser light, ah, that's base, DAB tuner, Bowers and Wilkins diamond surround sound system, M driver's package, the M competition package that's 17k extra if you would like to have the competition version 20 inch wheels styling 830m bmw co-pilot pack extended guarantee three years as a base selected options total options 39,113 euros and then we have the total end price in the netherlands including all taxes there we go 252,000 487 euros including all taxes all legal stuff all co2 stuff dutch price however if you would like to have a personal quote on this m8 with this spec or even a different spec or maybe even individual make sure to email me quote at carvlogger.com and i will make sure to bring you a personalized quote the bmw m8 competition convertible in Brand Hatch Grau, the flagship with no roof. Let's start on the nose. First of all, that new kidney. One part these days, this is almost black chrome. Very nice. In the center we have one of the cameras. So this is the M grill, you can see that it's always open. The M8 competition logo in black in the kidney. And here below the M air channels. So also this is all M. So this is a whole M bumper for M only. Down here the big sensor for all the driving assistance. Here on the left. You can see behind there. There you go, the intercooler. The right intercooler and the left intercooler cooling the air. This is all by the way gloss black. Combining very nice, pretty, pretty stealthy with the brand hatch gray. There you can see the metallic paint. Also down here, little left and right front splitter also in that gloss black. Headlights, the 8 series headlights, just like the M850i. You saw on the channel, laser lights optional and the hexagon 
day driving lights. So M meaning wider body than the regular versions. And here you can see it closely how the body is widened a little bit. And you can also see it on the side of the headlights. A normal M850i doesn't have this extra shapes on the side of the car. Continue to the wheels. Let's start on the front wheels. So new M design wheels. You can also see these wheel shapes on the new X6M and the X5M. Massive carbon ceramic brakes behind the M wheels, M competition wheels. 275, 35, 20 inch Michelin's high performance tires, gold calipers, always for BMW ceramics, six pistons, and yeah, the wheels are duo tone, gunmetal gray with gloss black. Here on the side, an optical M8 labeling, not functional anymore. This is only optical. M mirror, just like the M5, you can see the typical M mirror. Arrow VIN here, gloss black, and the window trim as well, gloss black. Side skirt, aggressive, typical M, pushing out the lines and entering or finishing the side lines of the car. Okay, roof folded down. I'll show you later on how the roof folds down and opens up. Rear wheels, again the carbon ceramic brakes, still gold colored calipers, single pistons, Pilot Sport 4S's and rear measures of 285, 35, 20 inch. Here you can see this is all finished in leather. These are the beautiful rear LEDs, 3D shaped. The little competition spoiler is also in gloss black. There you can recognize the competition version and also the competition exhaust finished with the tailpipes also in high gloss black. You can see how clean the exhaust is. So the rear diffuser also finished in gloss black, typical competition. Rear camera, part of the 3D camera, and that nice new logo M8 competition. Alright, the exterior check, it's time to uh, pop the hood, see the monstrous V8 by turbo engine and let's have a look first at the trunk. It's a convertible, don't be disappointed, control the trunk from the key as from the inside as from the trunk itself. This is the trunk space of the M8 convertible, so below here. Well, it's, this is this is seriously deep, guys. I don't know if you can see it, but this is pretty deep. So if you have a special lower suitcase, it fits right under this. The roof folds down in this space. Engine bay. 
Here we go, the same engine as the M5 competition. V8 by turbo. Very, very strong engine. Producing 625 horses. Oh, this is nice. Look at this carbon satin finish. Okay, let's continue to the interior of this M8 convertible. Okay, roof down, let's have a look at the door and the interior. This is the beautiful merino leather with black leather. You can see for the M8 what they have done. They have stitched these very nice diamond shapes with these perforated little holes in it. What a nice, nice shape. Combining with the Bowser Wilkins optional diamond surround sound system and that nice shape in the door. I really love the 8 series door, really, really do. So this is all black leather here, down here as well. Some gray stitching. Extra spots for your personal stuff, the button for the red trunk, and then this M8 competition LED enlightened door sill, carbon core. You can see the electric adjustable seats, and also these M seats have that nice diamond shape, merino leather with some black details as well. Also, here inside, very nice. M8 in the headrest and here some head heating for your neck yep 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 I like this entry pretty easy 8 series not too low not too high welcome inside I welcome you inside the M8 competition convertible Press buttons for the light switches, automatic lights, but of course, this is a little button for the brightness of the interior displays. Yes, yes, the battery needs to be charged. On top, you have the nice air vent finishes in silver. You can see how that all continues in the door shape. This is the BMW Live cockpit with the new design. If you put push M mode, this happens. Oof. This is M mode, guys. <laughs> very, very jet fighter like. So, on top of the dash, all black leather, continuing all the way to the passenger side. There you have the Bowens and Wilkins center speaker unit. Here you can see some nice interior lights. Wow, look at how nice the interior lights finishes out in that leather. So this is the new live cockpit of BMW for the M8. This is your M layout. Boom. Very jet fighter alike. Really like this. Like this concentration. Not too much info, but just your RPM meters for full focus and perfect ideal RPM shift down, shift up timing. Steering wheel, M steering wheel. Triple stitching, I need to say, triple stitching, because these are 3M colors. The M1 button, M2 button for your personal preferences. You can also see here in the center the ambient lighting. God, I love ambient lighting. <laughs> so here, down here on the feet, lower feet space. Okay, center console, I drive 7. Not to forget, this is a touch screen. So below the iDrive screen, we have the climate system and the two nice new finishes of the air vents. In every 8 series, you can find this new air vent shape with a nice touch and nice buttons. Intelligent safety button. 
Here are all the buttons for your climate system, seat heating and seat venting in one button. Down here the presets and the radio. To remind you, you're driving the M8 Competition. Carbon trim finishing. Two cup holders, USB-C input and wireless charging. Cigarette lighter, 12 volt. And then we have the new M gear knob. Look at this. This is the new M gear knob, guys. Here we have the button to control the character of the gearbox. Number one for <laughs> chill driving and chill shifting up. And number three, the most sport, aka holding the RPMs very high. Leather, triple stitching on M colors. Also M embossed where are you there you go also m embossed on the leather gear knob gear knob not too small not too big actually pretty perfect here you control everything of the car the whole iDrive control and the m modes where you can these days control there we go let's go for setup with the m modes now you can also control the brake you can control the brake from comfort to sport. And that's new, very, very nice. So actually you can see here, this is almost becoming a race car with your personal settings. I mean, if it was a race car, this would be, the list would be like ending, unending. For a street legal road car, this is pretty nice. So M setup, edit, braking selections. In the armrests, continuing with the merino brown leather, USB-C input, again, cigarette lighter, 12 volt input. And by the way, also this is housed in that carbon fiber trim finish. Nice finish on the rear view mirror, I like this thin mirror shape. LED buttons, SOS button. Let's hope we're never gonna use that. Kickaboo. <laughs> also, by the way, all finished in leather. Don't forget. Okay, rear section. So, a quick look in the rear section. Because the rear section of the 8 series isn't officially a rear section I mean there's the proof look there are two rear seats but actually you can't sit here because if I fold this back it's gonna kill my my legs nice bounce wilkes finishing in the doors here as well with a diamond leather finish pretty deep sitting position very stiff for the back. Yeah. But hey, if you would like to have an M8 with rear seats, you need to have the GC, aka the Grand Coupe. Right guys, interior check, exterior check, hood and trunk check. It's time to uh, start this up for you with some ref shots.
with the roof down guys <laughs> this thing sounds sick I mean it's not even on boost it's not even driving it's just on idle so I'm, I'm, I'm impressed on the sound of the M8 competition so don't forget the competition has a competition exhaust giving this <laughs> some more noise okay guys I want to thank you for watching the inside series of the M8 comp convertible if you need any info check out my links below shout out to my friends of BMW Amsterdam stay tuned for some cool stuff coming up from BMW Amsterdam the new whip it's gonna be an SUV for the winter stay tuned and I will see you definitely on the next video ciao